In Gary Vaynerchuk's book, Jab, 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 Right Hook, he suggests that the only way that you can build credibility or trust with an audience is by showing them authority and your experience or your expertise in your niche through value and extreme value. He even says, giving away my best content for free was my gateway drug to building all of these amazing opportunities and relationships around him. In today's video, I'm gonna show you how to give away all of your best tips and tricks related to your industry and how to give them away for free then to take that and turn it around and make a ton of money doing it. So stay tuned, let's go. Welcome back everybody, my name is Jordan Steen, AKA Serial Entrepreneur, thank you for joining me today. So for those of you that are just starting out in your entrepreneurial journey, you have to understand that if you want someone to trust you and believe you and start to actually follow your content or the information that you're releasing, you have to be able to build trust and credibility. As a matter of fact, it's the biggest challenge that most business owners have because they try to go out and they try to sell a product or service before they've ever shown an audience that they know what they're talking about. So the best way that you can actually do that is by giving away your best content or information related to your industry for free. So before we get into all of the this really cool information, make sure you do one thing beneficial to you and hit the subscribe button and then the notification bell right down below the bottom right hand corner in this video. And that will make sure that you get all of our free training, our giveaways, everything like that. So for a lot of you starting your marketing agency or if you're starting a personal brand, a lot of the time people ask me, well, Jordan, if I give it all away for free, then what value can I sell them? Like what product am I actually gonna sell them if I teach them how to do it all for free? And here's the trick. Usually if it's a personal brand and you're trying to give away the information, you just give away just enough to get them going, just enough that's gonna get them maybe a result that they're looking for, but it doesn't solve the whole piece of the pie, right? And so let's talk about how we broke this strategy down. So. For Facebook marketing, let's say that's our example, right? If we wanted to talk about Facebook marketing and show people that I was a Facebook marketing expert, how would I do this without giving everything away? Well, it's pretty simple actually. We'll go to the board and we'll say, okay, well, what are all of the Facebook marketing topics? We could talk about audiences, right, and targeting. I could talk about the pixel. I could talk about ad objectives, talk about business manager. And so here's the thing, I can create all of these different videos. And even just if I wanted to focus on business manager alone. I could focus on one specific tab in business manager, maybe and cre create a quick video on that. Maybe it's the account or the business settings tab where you're able to set up multiple accounts and multiple ad accounts, right? I could focus on that tab and just that one topic specifically and create a video on it. The, I guess the issue breaks down for those people. Everything is put out there, right? On YouTube and we're giving away all of this value for free, but it's all pieced out there separately. Everything, it's in 150, 250 different pieces with no structure, right? Even if you create playlists on your channel, that's fine, but here's the thing, it's still difficult to know where do I start and where do I end? How do I know I get? I have a starting place and an end point? And that's where putting together a product or something like that helps them get to that you know, end result that they're ultimately looking for, which is start here as a beginner, work your way down to here and know what you're doing, right? Become an expert, right? And so that's what this does. By giving away your content for free and basically promoting a product or service for free and giving that information out to your audience, you're able to build a relationship, show them that you know what you're talking about. Not only that, you can show them that you know what you're talking about and you're gonna be able to help them get the same desired result as well, right? And this relates to anything, whether it's a personal brand or whether it's a actual business in a local area. The next tip I wanna to talk to you guys about, and it's one of the most difficult ones to really stick to is consistency, okay? And here's what happens. It's either you're too busy already to create consistent content and you promise to do two videos a week or a video a week, right? That's very hard to do, to produce, to shoot, to come up with ideas and topics to cover every single time, provide the research, and really put together a quality product, right? So if you plan to do it on a daily basis, you need to have a team behind you to help facilitate all of the other aspects, the creative side, the design side, the copy side, the publishing, all of that stuff needs to be taken care of so that way you can focus on creating the actual content. But people usually get stuck and that's where they have an issue because they can't hold to that consistency. So they either try to do too much and then they can't get consistent, so it overwhelms them and they stop, 
or they aren't consistent in general. They'll post, you know, a video a week or two videos a week, and then they'll start to fall off, and then it'll get like one video every week sometimes, and then, you know, sometimes two videos a week, so their consistency drops off. And what happens is the audience starts to say, well, we don't know when the hell you're gonna upload videos, right? But if I can expect to upload those videos, then you can expect your audience to stay tuned and stay into what you're actually doing. If you do it consistently, your audience will love you for it, and they'll keep coming back over and over again. If they know when and where to find you, they're gonna come back as long as the content is quality. So creating a consistent, you know, content marketing plan can be, you know, challenging. So if you're looking for a video on that kind of training, check out this link up here in the top right hand corner. We'll show you a little bit about consistent marketing and planning and how to set up that content calendar. One of the next steps that you're actually going to want to take in your, you know, free content journey is actually have a plan for what happens after they consume your free stuff. Because ultimately, yes, you are trying to give value and give away free information but you need to make money to run your business, right? You can't just give away everything for free forever because, you know, how, how are you going to survive, right? How are you going to pay the bills? So when you create a plan to give away free content, so for example, in this example, we're going to give an ebook on how to make six figures online, you know, say that was our content or our value piece that we're trying to give away to our audience, right? we know that we want to follow up with these people in an email automation, right? So we're gonna send them a welcome email, then we're gonna send them that guide that we referred to here. Then we're gonna continue them through a, you know, more value content. We're not gonna to try to sell them in the next two emails. We might wait till the third, fifth email, something like that to actually, or well, fourth or fifth email to try and sell them anything or introduce them to a product, right? Because it's a cold lead. What we also know is that once someone reads this email right here, we want to send them through a Facebook remarketing audience, right? We will, we will add them to a remarketing audience on Facebook and we do that by knowing that they open this email and then that's it. Now we're remarketing to them on Facebook and Instagram. So we have a plan to actually monetize. We say that, okay, you know, we're driving this value content and then ultimately this value content, this would be the last one right here, you know, it would go through another series of other, you know, value content here, right? And then there'd be other ads coming off over here to remarket to them and, you know, show them the opportunity, testimonial, stuff like that, whatever your product is. And then ultimately you're driving them to this sales page, right? The sales page here is where you're actually going to try and get them to buy the product. And so you have to work them through some content and provide value and show them your authority and your, your value to them, why your product or your service is important to them and why they can use it. And that's what this content flow, this sales funnel, really uh, ad funnel does to land clients and land, you know, more customers for whatever, you know, personal brand or client that you're trying to work this campaign for. And my final piece of advice to you guys, and this is something we think we do a really great job at, is following up with the people who actually purchase your product and keeping them involved with your brand. So you want to actually create some remarketing campaigns or onboarding type campaigns for the people who actually sign on or purchase whatever product or service it is that you offer. And again, this is gonna build that trust and credibility with them and make them more willing to go out and talk about and promote your product or service to other people. Oh, and if you need help creating content for any type of brand or business out there and you struggle with coming up with ideas, check out this video we put together up here in the top right hand corner and we'll show you how we come up with our really cool content ideas every single week. Really quickly guys, have you tried to give away value before for either a business or for a client or something like that and it hasn't worked out well for you as far as getting new leads or people interested in that content you're creating? If so, leave a comment below saying that yeah, that's happened to me. I'd like to discuss why and figure out what is it maybe about that experience that you're audience didn't enjoy or figure out why they didn't download whatever template or, you know, sign on for whatever value that you were trying to give away. That's it for me, everybody. I'm going to get out of here for today. Make sure you hit that subscribe button and the notification bell at the bottom right hand corner of this video so that way you get all of our training and our free content and free giveaways that we do here at Serial Entrepreneur. Oh, and do me a favor, hit the thumbs up right below this video if you found value in today's lesson. But until next time, guys, Serial Entrepreneur out. See you. Mm. Work brain. Ready to start living the six figure work wherever be your own boss lifestyle? Well, at Serial Entrepreneur Academy, we'll teach you how to use a laptop and internet to start your own social media and digital marketing agency. Get started with our free Facebook ads training. Links in the description below, guys. See you in the course. Serial Entrepreneur out.